Hello, my crafty friends. I am back again <laughs> with uh, my latest little journal I made. I'm calling it, uh, what am I calling it? My uh, Victorian Lady's Diary. Because um, it's just so sweet looking. It's small. And uh, I love this material here. I found it at the bins. It's really neat. It's some kind of faux leathery, velvety, I don't know. But, um, so anyway, it's really cute. I just love the way this turned out with lots of laces and uh, antique, you know, laces and stuff and a cameo here and down here, the center of the signatures, um, there's a couple charms. One says memories and the other one is another little cameo. I thought that looked really cute. Um, I colored this with some um, alcohol inks because it was kind of really bright. But anyhow, it's uh, got three signatures sewn in with uh, the one, two, three, okay, I don't know, three whole pamphlet <laughs> stitch, I think. I can't see it now. Anyway, it measures um, like three and a quarter across by five and a half long. Don't ask me why. I think it was because I used a box of something edible and it was just that was the size of the box so anyway here we go we'll go inside this just ties around comes right off it's not attached because it was a little bit uh, alligator mouth by the time I was finished with it <laughs> so it kind of needed something so it's just tied around like that you can see so let's go inside. So inside here, I used um, Stamperia. I don't know what it's called, uh, something lace. But anyway, I love that paper so much. And I have a little uh, this journal belongs to thing there. And I have lace along some of the edges. And I have some um, printed. Um, like doily dyed papers from a digital download and then I also have um, some um, actual ones in here too I did a lot of um, stenciling and these are cutouts from that stamp area collection it's just a cute little size that you can throw in your purse this flips up a Rita Donnelly flip there's some um, old sheet music and there's a little tuck on this side. This, oops, with this little photo, it's so pretty. And that's from Daisy at um, Tsunami Rose. And just some ephemera. I decided to stick in there. And it's just, you know, I didn't heavily decorate it, but you know, I put some little laces here and there and different size papers and this is coffee dyed with some stenciling that I did uh, some old school paper it's got a lot of pages I, I forgot how many but it's a lot so I'm gonna probably flip pretty quick there's some stamping here and there this is some old vintage ledger paper from the 40s here's some old vintage lace here I just made a flip up This is a uh, coffee stained and some ephemera in there. There's lots of places to write in here. It's mainly, you know, for writing. Isn't that pretty right there? Oh, I love that way that turned out. Line paper with some stenciling. There's some paper that I did a bunch of stuff to. <laughs> More stenciling. Old coffee stain doily. This is a really old leather sheet here that I coffee stained with doilies and it just came out kind of all smeared and stuff. It's pretty neat. Coffee stain about. So it pretty much just goes like this throughout the whole thing. Let's see. Well, here I have a little um, glassine envelope with a little journaling card in there.
Jenkins, and it's a tuck too. And that's the center of that signature. Here I have a little lace side pocket tuck thing, and I have this little dress here. Turned out really cute. And here's just a little embellishment there. And here's a little side tuck, and I have um, a vintage, very old vintage um, prescription. That's the original. Yeah, kind of ripped, but it's very old. <laughs> from like the 1800s and then here's a little cute little envelope with some paper in it so you can write tiny things tiny secrets <laughs> okay let's see I hope I don't run out of time some more of that um, some more ledgers I don't know if it's the same one yeah it's from the 40s original and uh, more papers and little stamping and coffee dyed and that good stuff this is a uh, music paper more stenciling I love that stencil that's really pretty and here's that stamperia paper and then between uh, the two signatures this is some really old vintage it was a hanky from a friend of mine's grandmother it's like paper thin. It's so cool. I love it. So, oops, sorry. Put that in there. I thought that looked really sweet. And then here we are in the beginning of the other signature here. A little tag. Oh, there's my dog again. This flips out. Yep. Let's just move along here. <laughs> Here's another, uh, this is a glassine bag, and uh, has this pretty tag in there, German tag, coffee stained the bag, and another ledger page, a doily with uh, some French stuff stamped on it, this folds out. And this is the old ledger page. I just folded down the corner and did uh, put one of the cutouts from the Stamperia collection there. Doily paper, pocket tuck. There's a little journaling card, and this is a an old vintage uh, check, blank check from the early 1900s. Some washi tape there. All different papers. This is the center of the signature, and it, I printed this on um, tracing paper. It has lines you can write. A little Tim Holtz uh, niece or something. And I like this too, this little uh, dress form. And I put like a little ruffle for the skirt on there. <laughs> and in there we have a little tiny wingy library card and a tag. And there's a copy of some ephemera from uh, 1898. And here's some old ledger paper and some the lace that you saw sticking out as a little flip. And I have this pretty, pretty photograph of this. Get my fingers on it right of this lady. Just tucks under there. And 
little paper doily. Another half. This is from 1941. Ledger. And let's see. There's a. This is just a pocket, corner pocket with a, this cute tag. A lot of pages in this little thing. More music paper. Um, another pocket here with another tag. And that's the end of that signature. And then there's the other half of the uh, handkerchief. A pretty handkerchief. It's so thin. And this is the last signature here. This flips out. Music paper, stenciling. Yeah, no. The same old, same old. Oh, here's um, Tim Holtz's uh, aunt. And here's a little side tuck with a little flower and a dress for him. And just a piece of uh, ephemera. Checking account balance or something. <laughs> another doily. Another pocket. With a tag. This is the prettiest um, paper pack. I love this one. I love all these prints too. I forget exactly where I got them. But it was a digital download. Grandma's keepsakes maybe or something like that. Oh, I'm just not sure. Another uh, lace side pocket. The corset tag. Okay. I'm getting to the end here. Just a piece of paper in there. And another tuck area with more little tiny weeny tags. So, there's another little side tuck with a Pretty photo again. And some ephemera. Okay, so now we're at the end, I think. And that's about it. But I just wanted to share this with you. And I uh, hope you liked it. Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think. And um, I'll see you next time. Thanks a lot for watching, you guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.